If you've decided this year that this is the year that you want to write a book, I promise you by the end of this video, you're going to be able to have the steps specifically so that you could be a published author. Hey, my name is Kyle King. I'm the CEO and founder of The Writer's Game, where we help individuals just like yourself, experienced professionals, entrepreneurs, write, publish, promote, and then profit from their book. In my newest book, The Writer's Game, The Business Behind Your Story, you can get this on all channels, all anywhere that can purchase books. It talks about our strategic process to being able to help you write an amazing, and not just a best-selling book, but a profitable book, a book that sells, how to write it, how to publish it, how to promote the book from a launch and pre-launch, and then just a marketing perspective, and then how to build a business beyond your story. So check the link below to get the writer's game, the business behind your story today. If you are interested in writing your book, the first question that I always get is where do I start? Where do I start in this writing and this publishing journey? And to answer that question specifically is you start with determining your goals and objectives. The question that I ask authors all the time is where do you want this book to take you? What are your income related goals? What are your impact related goals? What type of money do you want to be able to make? Are there personal things that you want to be able to accomplish that, that this book can help you do? Are there professional things that you want to be able to accomplish that this book can help you achieve as well? Once we understand the impact that we want to create and the income that we want to be able to create from our book, now it's about answering the question, what is the big problem that the book is solving? When you think about anything, really anything, it's the size of your paycheck is determined by the size of the problem that you're solving. So in this book, with this concept that you have, what problem are you going to be solving? And then when you think about that specific problem, who is the person that is struggling most with that problem? Oftentimes we write books with a buyer in mind, but is the buyer the same person as the user? Is the user the same person as the benefiter? Because oftentimes those three people may be three complete, completely different people or the same person, the buyer, the benefiter, and the user. Is the same people that are using the book going to benefit from the contents within the book? Is the same people that are buying the book the same people that are going to benefit and vice versa? So when you think about that, who is the actual person that is going to benefit by that problem being solved? And then when you think about this major problem, it's time for you to put a message statement in place. How are you going to solve this problem? This book helps entrepreneurs and executives solve the problem of not being able to increase revenue, not being able to increase visibility, and not being able to grow their business by teaching them a methodical process and proven techniques that drive their business forward through creation of a book and a business beyond the story, okay? So when you think about the overall problem and the concept and how you're going to solve that problem for this specific type of people, create that into a message statement. And when you think about a title of a book, the title is simply the hook, the anecdote, the shocking statement, the wow factor. When you think of the writer's game, that's just the title. And then I'm helping you build the business beyond the story. When you think of books like Start With Why by Simon Sinek, it's how leaders, great leaders, inspire actions on their team. So that's the purpose. When you think of the subtitle, it's the explanation and the purpose. So once you have your message statement, it most times helps you create your overall title and subtitle. Once you have this, then I need you to break down your specific model or your specific chapters or framework within five steps. Number one is your hook, of course. Number two is your objective and thesis. Number three is your key takeaways. Number four are your chapter is your chapter content. And then number five is the bridge statement that transitions a reader from this point or this chapter into the next. Now, before that part happens, you have to have a strong framework and that transformative process that gets that reader from where they are right now to the end, which is that big idea, that solution at the end, and all of the steps in the middle serve as your chapters. And then now you have a bulleted framework to be able to break down each and individual chapter. Okay. Once we've been able to map out that content, once we've been able to to build the framework, I recommend you speeding up your process by 82% by recording yourself through platforms like Otter or Trent 
or Google to be able to dictate your book rather than sitting and typing your book. This allows you to do multiple things, not just speed up your work, but also get all of those thoughts down on paper. It allows you to do this brain dumping process. And then once you have that done, you're able to export it, put it in a Google Doc or a Word document, and begin to start writing out the content, editing the content, and ensuring that all of the content is up to your standard. Once you've been able to do that, we definitely recommend you going through an editing process, a professional editor is is non-negotiable in this process go go work with a professional editor that cleans up the perspectives cleans up the topics cleans up the topic or, or the content and allows you to take through a proofreading structural editing and developmental editing once they're able to do that the book will then come back to you you'll be able to review go through the book and then at that point you're ready to purchase your isbn write your book description write your author bio format the book internally through different systems or softwares, and then you'll be able to get KDP to publish it through Amazon or Ingram Spark so that you could be able to have expanded distribution. That is the steps. Those are the steps to be able to at least get your book started and published. Now, a lot of the different pieces in the middle of this are a lot of self-limiting beliefs that come up, um, answering questions or asking questions in regards to what type of content do I need to write? How do I know that the book is done? And all of the rest of the answers that you probably would have on this journey, you can you could have or you can have answered on our platform. Subscribe to the platform, go to our page and begin to binge watch the rest of the content. Your journey of finishing up your book in 2023 starts today. It starts with the big problem. It starts with you understanding your objectives. It starts with you understanding the person that you're actually writing this book for and really being able to differentiate the buyer, the benefiter, and the user for this book. Then structure out and illustrate your roadmap within your specific content. Visualize the transformation and then begin to buy the essentials, ISBN, barcode, book cover design, and all of the other elements that will help you with your uploading process, securing the best uploading process that works for your needs, pricing the book, and then being able to press submit and publish a book. If you need help, then I would definitely recommend you start with purchasing the writer's game, the business behind your story, going to our website in the link below and reaching out to our team and asking us how we can support you in this process. We look forward to seeing you um, in the next video, in the next episode, and we'll see you soon.